Hey, good morning to everybody. A happy Friday. It's Daryl here. It is bright and freaking early. It's 5.30 a.m. here in Connecticut on the East Coast. And as usual, if you watch my channel, you know I'm usually here at 3.30. I'm running late. It's a Friday. I'm running late. And uh, I want to talk about a few things. If you're like me, this story has been in your peripheral vision for a while now. And I've been wanting to talk about it. There's a few reasons why I haven't talked about it. And I was wondering if it might eventually or somehow affect me and this channel. Okay, let me start at the very beginning. As you can see, being an artist and having this channel and uh, being in recovery, keeping up with my, my recovery and working out and exercise and staying in good health, I'm very busy. And uh, this is something I, I, I hesitate to admit. Uh, a lot of you found my channel through Bo of the Fifth, Bo of the fifth Column. You know, that's basically how this channel grew. Uh, I only had, I was getting a few views a day and I came across Bo and I did a video. Let's talk about Bo of the fifth column. Uh, I'll put a link to that down below. And that, that video got 167,000 views uh, at least. And uh, Bo featured it on his channel. I don't know if he still has it up, but it was on, he had uh, what people are saying about me, other channels. Uh, he had 10 videos there. I don't, like I said, I'm not sure if my video is still there or not. But, uh, you know, my, my viewers my, and my views went through the roof. It, it's, it's what allowed me to actually get monetized here on this channel. Okay, so this, uh, this story about blogger laws in Florida. I, it's been in, in my peripheral vision for a few days now. And I've been wanting to talk about it. And I was wondering if Bo the Fifth Column has talked about it all. And here's what I, I hate to admit I've been so busy over the last year, I don't know, year or two. I, I, you know, I used to watch Bo's videos every day. I knew when, they, you know, when the next one, I'd, I'd have them timed out. You know, I'd be one of those people that would race to be the first one in the comments. You know, I, I, but lately, I just have not had the time, not only not to watch Bo, Bo I, I hesitate to say this, but I haven't had the time to watch Bo's videos. I really haven't. I'm still a huge supporter and a huge fan. But I haven't, I haven't had the time to watch any YouTube videos. Like, I'll check mine. I do mine in the morning. And that's it for the day lately. I, I, I don't even go back to YouTube because I am so busy keeping up with other stuff in my life. Which is good in a lot of ways. But, okay, so this story pops up. And this is the way I understood it initially. This, this, the reason for this video is because I found out something. that was kind of... It's... It, it, I thought Ron DeSantis was uh, at the center of this, this story about, and I was wondering what Bo the Fifth Column thought about this too, because this might directly affect him. It's proposed legislation that bloggers, newspapers, websites, people that talk about the governor, the lieutenant governor, uh, the leadership of Florida, the politicians of Florida, that if they talk about, if any bloggers or media sites talk about these people, the, the governor or any of the politicians, they have to register within five days with the state, which sounds insane. It sounds, you know, it's, it's, it sounds like something out of Germany, you know, totally against the First Amendment. You know, it, it seems like it's trying to stifle the free press, which it kind of is. Um, they would have to register with the state. Now, this is, was proposed legislation. It still hasn't been all sorted out yet. It hasn't been signed. And uh, they would have to list how much money they make, like me, how, how much, you know, if, if they get paid, they'd have to register. Like somebody like me or both at Fifth Column would have to register, tell them how much money they make, who's paying them, uh, and do all this within five days. Or they could be fined up to $25, $25 a day, up to a cap of $2,500 Per video, which could add up to be a lot, especially for a, for a small channel like me, it could be crazy significant. Okay, so seeing as you know, I was under the impression that it was Ron DeSantis's bill, and then I saw a few posts here and there. I saw a few uh, stories saying that Ron DeSantis was backing away from this now, that he's not in favor of it. You know, and I was like, oh, he's just trying to get out of this, you know. But then I looked it up, like in the AP, the Associated Press had, um, you know, uh, false, true or false kind of thing. I'll have that link down below. And this is not DeSantis' is bill. And from everything I can figure out, um, he's not, in, he's saying he's not in favor of it. 
Uh, that still has yet to be seen. Uh, you know, I don't trust politicians as far as I could throw them. But this is not DeSantis's bill. You know, I and there's still there's still sites out there that are saying that this is DeSantis's bill. That DeSantis is responsible for this. Uh, maybe in the background he's pulling strings, but up front he's saying that he is not in favor of this. Um, this is uh, legislation from I think Jason Broder, uh, Representative Jason Broder from Florida is the guy that came up with this legislation, um, and uh, it's it's scary. It's 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 just an outright way to uh, to stifle the free press. And even if Ron DeSantis is saying that he's not in favor of it now, it's yet to be seen because he he put out a statement saying that he consider even though he's not in favor of it that he carefully considers all legislation that go, comes across his desk. So he's going to give it some even though he claims to be against it. Um, this morning, I just I found all these articles. Like I said initially, I thought this was like Ron DeSantis's legislation, like his bill, like his whole thing, and it's really not. It doesn't appear to be. Um, I was trying to find, because I haven't been able to, to see my usual, watch my usual Bo the Fifth Column videos, I was Googling things like Bo the Fifth Column, Blogger Laws, Ron DeSantis, and that's where I came up with this information. And like I said, I, I'm kind of amazed that there's still um, media sites out there that are, they're not coming right out and saying, but they're they're insinuating that this is Ron DeSantis's legislation. It's his bill. It's his proposed legislation, and it's not. You know, and uh, I thought about that too. And it's it's when when you when you don't put the truth out there, like I you know, like it's not my channel isn't usually somebody that would stick up or defend Ron DeSantis, and that's almost you know. But this is the truth. It's really not his bill, and. Uh, this is the excuse people like Jason Broder use to make up these laws. They say that the, the press is lying and making up, you know, making up false stories about them. And it all, it's almost like it all comes around in a big circle. So anyway, the links will be down below. Uh, I'm sorry I'm running late today. Usually I, I would have taken a lot more time to prepare this video. Uh, but I was really interested in what Bo the Fifth Column thought of this. Uh, I, I don't think this legislation has any chance in uh, in Hades of, of ever passing because it's it's so insanely anti First Amendment. I mean, it just it's blatant. Uh, it's a blatant, blatant tactic to uh, intimidate people like Bo the Fifth Column or even me or, or any any more left leaning. Uh, anybody, anybody that crit anybody that dares criticize Ron DeSantis or the governor, you know, the lieutenant governor, or the the leadership of Florida, uh, to stifle them. Anyway, the links will be down below. I urge you guys to read it yourself so you know the truth. Because, like I said, up till this morning, I was under the false impression that Ron DeSantis was the main backer of this bill, and apparently he is not, and he claims he's not even in favor of it. It's yet to be seen. Uh, if any of you guys know, if Bo the Fifth Column, because he, he does like three videos a day, if any of you guys know of one of his videos, please give me uh, in the comments, tell me which video so I could see what he's, if he's talking about this yet, uh, if he's, what he's got to say about it. All right, I'll be back later with another video, you guys. Have a great Friday.